Very pleased with the uh, practice today. Uh, guys were excited to be out here. Uh, I don't know if it's the the victory or the the weather or uh, it's uh, guys were excited to be on a football team and practicing today and it, we uh, consequently got better and we need that energy throughout the rest of our season if we're going to make it a successful season. And we've got a tall order going up to Seattle to play uh, University of Washington, uh, so it will be a uh, uh, no pun intended a dog fight and and it will we, we've, we've got to uh, we've got to be ready for that so I'm looking forward to the challenge you talk about personally what it's like for you to go to Washington uh, you know that was a, it was a big deal the first time uh, two years ago going back and that doesn't mean that this is any less significant it's just, it just it isn't as uh, maybe emotional for my personal family you know as it might have been the, the last time but uh, uh, it's a it's a big game for both programs because we're both trying to stay alive in, in postseason race so uh, I mean there'll be plenty of excitement going up there what's locker give them that maybe the other guy well Jake has you know a boatload of experience you know and, and uh, has been in these kind of games and 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 uh, has been successful so uh, and, and and Keith obviously is a very talented guy you can see that in in the brief amount of time he's been in games and I know that uh, they're excited about his future as well so but both are mobile guys so I don't I don't see a real difference in how we approach uh, defending their offense Eddie's uh, just resting a foot, you know, a slight ankle sprain, just trying to get him well. I don't know if he'll practice uh, here the next couple of days, just trying to rest him up a little bit. Yeah, I, I'm, yeah he'll be ready to go on for sure on Sunday. Laramore, we're, we're, he's going to see the doctors tonight, and we'll see exactly where he is. Dalton uh, is in the, the uh, concussion protocol deal, which now means tomorrow he'll be out here, I think, with a red jersey. And uh, if all goes well, then you know probably won't hit, do any hitting until Sunday. But uh, I think he can practice starting tomorrow. What's a couple things you want to work on this weekend, this week that you have the time? We've got to work on pass protection. We've got to be a better uh, pass protecting team so that we can throw the ball a little bit more efficiency. Uh, we've got to continue to work on uh, uh, our tackling. You know, we'll, uh, you know, it was much improved, but that was because we focused on it a little bit last week. We don't want to lose that. Uh, there are a number of things that uh, we can we can oil up, uh, and, and obviously, you know, we're we're still neophytes with respect to the pistol offense, so we're going to try to keep working at that. Yeah, you know, he doesn't have a lot of experience, so we got some luxury of extra reps. We want to, you know. Make, make sure that we give him as much experience as we can should we need him. No, 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 Richard's fine. How spirited the practice was, did, did you kind of manipulate that a little, or did that come from them? I... It really honestly came from them. They were excited to be out here, and we were having fun, and I did not want to curtail it. I wanted it to to, to be that. Football's supposed to be fun. It's a hard game to practice, but... Uh, when you get that kind of energy, you, you want to you want to capitalize on it. So, and, and as I told him at the end of practice, if we have anything less than that kind of enthusiasm from here on out, we're cheating ourselves because uh, this is a fun game, and they do like each other. And you know, obviously, winning for the first time in a while it makes everybody feel a little bit better. But but we have a chance to really improve if we bring that kind of energy every day. Did you see a difference in Malcolm Johnson this last game? Uh, you know, I saw that uh, he was moving the pile again, and uh, it was fun to see. Uh, and, and, you know, I, I think Malcolm is a non-complainer. <laughs> I think, you know, he never ever says anything. But I don't know that he was totally healthy. I think he was kind of nursing an ankle back to health, and I think you can kind of see a little more bounce in his step right now. He did a much better job uh, containing the quarterback in the running game against Oregon State. Right. Does that give you a little more? Well, uh, a little more focus, you know, in terms of when you get home, getting the guy down. Both Zumwalt and, and uh, Keem and, and uh, Westgate all had sake, all had sacks, and all of them, you know, got him down. You know, it wasn't they weren't the second guy there; they were the first guy there in all those cases, and, and got him down. So uh, that that's key as we go forward. I, uh, you know, he was one of our special teams players of the game, and you know, I, I, I 
he's an all-american i mean he he does some really really big things for us with regard to field position whether it's kicking the ball out of the end zone so that we start on the 20 and basically saving us a first down or is it or if it's a uh you know, pinning him down on the two-yard line as he did the other night. That was a huge play in the game. I mean, he's a, obviously a gifted punter in terms of the amount of time the ball stays in the air and so forth, but, but the, what he means to us from a field position standpoint is huge. Coach, did you get a chance to look at your future schedules? Those came out on Friday. I did. I did. I, meant, I looked at this, yeah. Uh, you know, the, the only – our schedule remains really a little bit unchanged because – the home and home away games were as they would have been with the exception of Washington State. We get Washington State at home again uh, in this deal. Uh, not playing Oregon and Washington, you know, uh, you can look at both sides of the coin at that, I guess. And, uh, but uh, I think that uh, playing uh, Utah on the road will be a big time challenge. And, you know, I was kind of hoping to get to go to Boulder, you know, having uh, old memories, but that will be a year after that. So. Uh, you know that's what the conference decided to do. I, I, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm along for the ride. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll play them every time we they're on the schedule. All right. <laughs>